Recording our dreams on video, how close are we to achieving it? Find out. Hi. I'm here today to bring you the latest fashion tech news that you need to know. My name is Anina and I'm the CEO of 360 Fashion Network. Before we start, if you want to receive this news roundup regularly, then hit that like button and smash that follow as we will be bringing you this new every week to keep you in the know of the top stories we think are important. Alright, first up, is artificial intelligence about to take over the fashion world, one runway at a time? AI-powered text-to-image generators like OpenAI's Dolly and Midjourney have gone absolutely viral, and for good reason. These programs, though still in beta, are already starting to make their way into creative industries. Fast fashion sites value quantity above all else, some of them churning out thousands of new designs daily. AI could make that process even faster, which ultimately helps their bottom line. Meanwhile, a number of brands have begun to utilize the metaverse where at least one digital fashion show has already taken place as a space to sell their goods, and digital influencers have raked in millions of followers. AI could certainly find its place within any of these operations, especially, for volume and speed. News Source, Futurism, If you're prone to forgetting where you left your keys, you're in luck. A new app promises to let you record memories on a smartphone and then relive them in virtual reality, just like in Black Mirror. One episode from the dystopian Netflix series showed a future where people could access their memories through an implant that records everything they see and do with deadly consequences. Now tech startup Wist has released an app which lets you do just that, by recording memories in 360 degrees and allowing you to relive them through a virtual reality headset. News Source, Daily Star, an indie-based tech company that received an Indiana Innovation Grant, is using virtual reality to keep police in Indianapolis emotionally healthy. It's a convergence of science and public safety, helping IMPD officers reduce stress on the job. PeakMind uses science, software, virtual reality and biometric data to improve mental health in the workplace. 55 IMPD officers are currently active in the program. Before and after their shifts, officers sign in, put on VR goggles, get a series of simulations and learn coping skills for crises that come with the job. The AI-powered intervention is happening in the labs of Peak Mind. Dr. Alicia McCoy developed the technology that earned a 48,000 grant from the state to expand. News Source, WTHR, combining fashion, history, and technology is something captivating. Russell Clemus, light painter and synthographer basically meaning he uses computer software and machine learning to create digital art, created a short video taking folks on a visual journey of women's fashion through the 21st century. In only 30 seconds, we time travel from 1910 to 2010. The sheer volume of different looks is staggering, from long, layered Edwardian skirts and beaded flapper dresses, through form-fitting World War II attire and bell bottoms, all the way to more contemporary casual sportswear styles that clearly show just how much more active many women have become. News Source, Upworthy, Epson's dry fiber technology, which recycles paper without using any water, can now be applied to the production of printable non-woven fabric from recycled clothing. This new method of fabric production, developed over the course of a three-year partnership between Epson and Japanese designer Yuma Nakazato, debuted in Paris, where it was also used for the first time in Nakazato's Palais de Tokyo runway show. Because of Epson's printing support, Yuo Nakazato's couture designs can be mass-produced with minimal environmental impact. Epson and Yuo Nakazato aim to bring attention to the problems of water and material waste caused by overproduction. Sustainable and zero-waste digital textile printing using pigment inks was on display in his collection. News Source, Apparel Resources and that's it for today. If you want to get the full top 10 fashion tech news items of the week, check out our new podcast 360 Fashion or go to 360fashion.net slash podcast or search for it on your favorite podcast platform. Don't forget to subscribe so that you won't miss our latest episode. Get to